clinically viable wearable sensor. Control platform using silicon carbide MOSFETs and Camus protocol. The MPT gate hip simulator. Electrostatic discharge, creating a pulse current source. Take semiconductor lids and place them on top of semiconductor module packs. Big data analysis for internet topology. Uh, it's the number one selling app on the iOS app store. says that the torques of the human hip are actually very small. What this does basically is it simulates the vertical and the angular displacement of the hip in order to test Dr. Gregg's powered prosthetics. The goal here was to provide physical therapists with the ability to hold patients accountable for completing exercises at home. There's a lot of devices that are connected to the internet today and we wanted a way to actually map out those devices into a really integratable way. To be able to conceptualize a design from the requirements to seeing it working and in action it is really, really fulfilling and I think that's why I wanted to be an engineer. I think one of the biggest challenges was the integration of the software side with the hardware side. Some unique challenges that my team has had to overcome were uh, providing a very specialized system to a group of people who uh, didn't know how to acquire such a system. UT Design helped us a lot in, in this project by basically giving us the, the, the room to work. They gave us our table that, that's right behind me. They gave us all the tools necessary to work out of the machine over there. And they gave us uh, a workshop in the back that we could go to at any time. And then UT Design sort of uh, took the burden of ordering and processing shipments off of us. Once we had mapped out the devices, what we ended up doing was we used that mapping to control those devices remotely within the network. As a proof of concept, we connected a drone uh, and then controlled the drone remotely via a laptop. Just, it's a story, like it's so deep, you get so involved, you can actually feel all the emotions. So now that there will be an Android version out, we would be able to reach so many more people and I can have one on my phone, so that would be awesome.